Get paid, young nurse, get paid. 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 What's good, everybody? It's your man, CJ Kyles, also known as the High Value Nurse, checking in once again, back with a brand new video. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let me give a shout out first and foremost to the lead attorney for just hitting 100,000 subscribers, over 100,000 subscribers. Second of all, let me give a shout out uh, to Lee for giving me the spotlight, letting me pull up on his channel and all the people that have come over here from his channel. I greatly appreciate you and I greatly appreciate y'all for rocking with me. But if y'all are brand new and just seeing me for the first time, my name is CJ Kyles. I'm a licensed practical nurse. I changed my life in 11 months, okay? I went to school for 11 months, changed my life, elevated myself into a whole new tax bracket in just 11 months. We eating very well over here. And I talk about the ins and outs of the nursing game, but from a different perspective. So I would invite you to please like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of the new content that we got dropping over here daily it's been daily at this point so let, let's keep it let's keep it rocking and happy fresh nurse friday to all the nurses out there you dig what i'm saying now i understand there are people when they see my channel they see the high value nurse they probably expect me to talk nursing from a traditional standpoint they want me to talk about pathophysiology disease processes and all that stuff i'm telling you right now this is not that channel this is not that channel that's not my lane there are so many other channels that are dedicated to that and you should go check them out especially remar nursing shout out to miss regina at remar nursing shout out to registered nurse rn miss sarah over there those are two great channels that i look to when i was uh taking my nclex i look to those channels every single day just to keep my skills up and the knowledge sharp but i don't do that over here that's not what i do i talk about nursing from a different perspective you dig what i'm saying so if you can appreciate that please stick around i would love for you to be a part of the family now let's get into the video today let's get into the video today i want to talk about nurses have to be selfish nurses being selfish and nurses having to be selfish i'm gonna tell you something ladies and gentlemen when you take care of people for a living when you help heal the sick when you help people get better and get back to a um a way of life where they can function in a normal state or a somewhat normal state than they uh better than they came in before that's a great thing that's a great thing but sometimes us as nurses we can become lost in that you dig what i'm saying we can become lost in that and we begin to put ourselves on the back burner i am very good for that i don't fit why i used to be i don't do that anymore but we are very good for doing that and i know so many nurses that go through this they put everybody else first. They put their job first. They put their patients first. What you are supposed to do when you are at work in a, in a professional setting, you are supposed to very much put your patients first. But when you get home, they have their families. They're taking care of their families. They're taking care of their kids. They're taking care of their cousin. They're taking care of their grandma. They're taking care of their cousin who baby daddy just left them. They have a whole bunch of things on their plate. And with all that going on, we can forget to not put ourselves first and that's a bad thing ladies and gentlemen i'm here to tell you right now that is a bad thing that will cause you to stress out that will be cause you to become a mean person and that will cause you to hate your job i'm telling you right now when your priority is someone else for eight and 12 and 16 hours a day a lot of y'all working overtime a lot of y'all working more than <clears throat> working more than three days a week so i know a lot of y'all working full-time and overtime 
when you do that majority of the time outside of the responsibilities that you have to take care of in your normal life in your regular life that can be stressing that can that can that can pull on your soul a bit so you have to remember you got to put yourself first listen sometimes it's okay to say no you feel me it's okay to say no your sister needs somebody to babysit her baby because the baby daddy and her done fell out and uh she want to go on a date and have a hot girl summer no no you tell her to stay her butt at the crib and be a mother to that child you feel me or your brother can't pay his child support payments after he done had his eighth kid by the 10th woman and want you to uh, give him some paper and some change so he can get by on his weed habit to the next week. It don't work like that. You tell him, no, I cannot do it. I can't do it. I'm putting me first because check this out. If you don't put you first, everything around you will fall. If you don't put you first, you start to become sick. If you become sick, you can't work. If you don't work, you don't eat. It's really as simple as that. And I know it's easier said than done for some of us, but I'm telling you right now, nurses out there, especially you all that's working in these hospitals where these hospital beds are getting full and, and y'all are short staffed and it's crazy and people are dying every 10 minutes and all kind of crazy stuff going on after you get home after you get off work and you take that scrub off first of all you need to decompress sit in the car for five or ten minutes decompress don't take it out on the kids because you had a rough day because it happens don't take it out on your wife or your husband because you had a rough a rough day you decompress it's not their fault they didn't piss you off or they didn't cause your patient to die. Decompress. Take a deep breath. Go in the house. You go in the house. And you go from there. And I'm a big proponent. I'm an energy person, right? So to me, as a nurse, in my household, I don't like any negative energy. Because I'm dealing with people who are sick on a daily basis. So I'm, I'm in a somewhat negative space all the time because i'm trying to help people get better you dig what i'm saying and to people that's working in a hospital they are literally dealing with death they deal with death all day every day for the most part that's a very unnatural thing that's an unnatural thing that's why you have to put yourself first you have to that cannot be an option as a nurse seriously that cannot be an option if you don't put yourself first and you don't become a little bit more selfish you will live to regret it it was a woman in the uk and i talked about this on my channel before it was a woman in the uk who killed herself because she was taking on too much responsibility at work she put the job before herself i'm gonna tell you something right now ain't no job worth dying over i'm gonna say that one more time there is no job no job no job worth dying over it's no job worth dying over because guess what as soon as your body drop and before you get good and cold it is a help wanted sign and you will be replaced and that is the unfortunate thing about this game but at the end of the day it's business at the end of the day it's business it's business you have to remember that and once you got that in your head that is business it becomes a little bit more easier to start to put yourself first listen if you got a day off and your boss call you and say hey we really short can you please come in you don't gotta go in go in if you want to but you don't have to you're not obligated to go in there if you don't want to on your day off. That's your day off. That's your day to do whatever you want to do. Now, if you want to do that, go ahead. Go ahead. But don't let these managers and these uh, 
for these unit managers and all these other people make you feel like you have to do something you don't want to do you are the star player you have to put yourself first and i have to tell myself that sometimes yes i have to put me first because guess what if i don't all this falls that's it that's it it's over finito finish kaput dead so ladies and gentlemen that is my advice to you please 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 to all you nurses that's out there grinding getting the money now don't don't get me wrong i believe in working i believe in putting it in 60 hour gang is in full effect but you don't do that if it's going to have a negative effect on your health you know your body you know your limits at the end of the day you put yourself first nurses have to be selfish yes i become very selfish i put me first because if i don't put me first who will if i don't put me first who will i have to put me first because if i don't put me first this all falls and goes to pieces let me tell you something quit being so available to everybody and everything that's a good way to get taken advantage of all right so hopefully i gave you something of value i really hope y'all like this video it would do me such a great honor if you could hit that like button please subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything we drop in videos every single day we have a show tonight nine o'clock um should be a good one i hope to see you there so until next time i bid you adieu get paid young nurse get paid deuces <laughs>